Right, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do an update on two of the video series we've been doing. Uh, 2015, 16 Silverado uh, salvage recovery and a service bed build. So if you have not seen the previous video of where this truck started, I'll try to link it. I don't actually know how to link it, but uh, let's see if I can link that thing. Um, this truck was sideswiped at over 100 miles an hour by a drunk driver. Nope. Hey. And uh, hurt these doors and, and, you know, hurt the bed and everything like that. So I went and bought it from a junkyard and uh, replaced the doors, the uniside, got everything painted. So this is not a completion video. This is just an update. I still have to uh, cut and buff everything, uh, put our tags on there. There's still a lot of chrome and uh, little pieces missing here and there. Um, but got the bed on got it painted so check out the video of the salvage on this one and then i've also got another video series of where i got this bed from so bought this bed sitting out in the field for a thousand bucks and it started out a lot different than this too so got everything painted Got line X wrapped down around the front here and got my napide tail lights on. Got it completely line X all the way around. Let me see if uh let me see if I can get this tailgate close. Um so just decided to line X the entire back, got the custom made bumper on. Got the winch winch mounted up, still have wiring and everything. So not sure how good the lighting is here, but uh so we got the the boxes lined inside. Let's see if I can get a good photo of that. Got our seals, seals on, got all the napide door latches on. I still have the shocks to do on the doors. So painted the inside of the doors. Didn't end up painting the uh, the inside of the boxes. We just lined, lined them. I actually painted that on with the Raptor liner. So same on the front. That one needs washed a little bit. That a uh, little bit of overspray and everything, but we'll deal with that. So, I'm still going to bring this pinstriping. I ended up re-pinstriping this. I'm going to bring the pinstriping down onto the service bed. Like I said, everything needs buff and cut. I need the overspray cleaned up a little bit. Uh, we built a headache rack for it. Since this is a short bed, a headache rack makes this truck look funky. Uh, we didn't spend a lot of time on it, but... Uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and put the headache rack on. It does not do it any favors. This is about as good as the truck's going to look. And we still have uh, interior to do. So just ordered those parts. We've got the headliner, uh, the four airbags. We've got some airbags in the seat over there. Um, I, I got brand new seat belts put on it. All the parts are coming from the dealer. So trucks coming along nicely. Oh, still got parts everywhere. Let's go to the other. I still don't have the door handles on the outside. Runs good. I think we have around 52,000 miles on it. Um, I bought it about, I think we're about a year ago now. Um, it's, it's took me a long time to, to get this thing going. I've been cash flowing everything and, uh, been doing it as a side project. So, uh, 
have some new seat covers and airbags to put inside. We're going to try that, see how that goes. Um, brand new headliner, and hopefully I remember how to put all this stuff back together. This is the side I painted. Not great lighting, but it ended up really good. It's got a little bit of cellulite and everything in the paint right now, but like I said, buff and cut, and uh, everything will everything will go together pretty well. Still have uh, some of these boxes. I ran out of rap Raptor line, so got to finish Raptor line and prepping and cleaning and Raptor line in those boxes, putting the seals on. But this truck has came a very long ways. So, a little while, I'll, uh, I'll get all the rest together and maybe do a finishing video of it. And, uh, yeah, check out the channel. Like and subscribe if you can. Uh, a lot of cool projects. Um, I still got a lot of these projects rolling. And, uh, yeah, check out the channel. See if there's anything you like on there. We will see you the next time.